Thank you so much to SeatGeek for sponsoring this video. SeatGeek is an app that makes buying tickets easier. If you want to save $20, just enter code MADDEN20 and use the link below. Let's get into the video. What's up guys, Coach Madden, official trainer, YougoProBaseball.com, and today I've got four hand-eye coordination development drills that you can do if you want to be a better baseball player, have hand -eye coordinate, better hand-eye coordination because hand-eye coordination is super important in sports and especially in baseball because we're trying to hit a ball that's coming in 90 plus miles an hour and moving uh, as well as catch a ball uh, in the dirt, in the air, also moving 90, 100 mile an hour plus sometimes. Um, so hand-eye coordination is super important, especially in baseball and these four drills are gonna help you get better at that. The first drill uh, is gonna be mini ball drill and you're gonna need a few things. One, a web glove, um, also an eye patch, as well as a personal pitcher or a partner. Um, and what we're gonna do in this drill is we're just gonna catch mini balls uh, with one hand, with our catching hand, and one eye. Now it's very hard to do this with one eye uh, because it messes up your depth perception. I mean, try it just with a partner. Um, before you even get to this drill. It's super, super hard, uh, especially with one eye, but it's really gonna make your eyes stronger and catching the mini balls with this mini glove. This drill is just tremendous for working on hand-eye coordination. And when you're working with two eyes and regular size glove and balls, it's gonna be so much easier, especially after coming from this thing because you gotta focus so hard to catch these mini balls. All right, for the second drill, we're gonna do over the shoulder throws off of the wall, and you're gonna need a partner with this and some bouncy balls. These are the cross balls. Um, you can use a racquetball, tennis balls, whatever, any kind of bouncy ball that you got. You can do this drill as a catcher uh, in the catcher's position or as a fielder. We'll show you both right here. You're just gonna get a partner behind you. You'll be in that catcher's drill. He's gonna throw balls over your shoulder. You're not really knowing where they're gonna be at, and you gotta catch them, soft hands, frame them as a catcher. And then we could also do this drill as a fielder. Have your partner back there throwing balls. You're not seeing where he's at, throwing those balls. He can work you side to side, fielding that ball out in front, working backhand, glove hand, fielding that ball because you're not seeing where the ball is coming from because the coach is behind you and you have to react quickly and have good hand-eye coordination to field the baseball. All right, so for the third drill, we're gonna do ball drops. Uh, you're gonna need a partner for this. You can use the same ball you use for the wall throws. Partner's gonna hold the ball, he's gonna drop it, and your job is to catch it before it hits the ground the second time. So this is great to work on hand-eye coordination, as well as that first step explosiveness. And the fourth hand-eye coordination drill for baseball, and this one you might not have thought of, is gonna be juggling. Just working on juggling three balls. It's great for hand-eye coordination really working on having this soft vision as you're catching these balls and working on those hands. Uh, and it's gonna make you a better fielder, believe it or not. The better you can be at juggling, it's gonna help you in the baseball field. Work on those four drills. Uh, they're great for development, hand-eye coordination. You're gonna like that, those drills, they're fun to do. Uh, implement them into your practices and let me know um, how they work for you. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Don't forget to, forget to click my logo right here. Uh, and then hit that subscribe button. Watch my newest video because you're going to like that one. And then leave me a comment below and let me know what you want to see in some upcoming videos. I'll talk to you guys down below. Thanks a lot.